So right now I'm down here in Sochi at an abandoned Soviet sanatorium that was built during the Soviet Union as a way for the elites to go and get, well, like a health resort. It's what a sanatorium is essentially. So check it out, this is the uh, entrance going all the way up. And then it's come all the way back down. It's kind of have to go to like a security checkpoint. But this place is uh, supposedly magical. Just didn't realize how long it takes to get up to the sanatorium. Because I'm still snaking up and down the road just to get to the main entrance because there, there was an entrance back down there where you could have gone through but the problem was it was locked so now I have to go all the way up the long route so long story short uh, the uh, original sanatorium is closed you can't get in not allowed in because it's crumbling apart and they're rebuilding it for um, uh, I don't know, maybe to restore or something, but there's people going in there anyway, so I managed to get over the fence, uh, get around the fence, uh, climb through a kind of like a hole, and I was in there for about 15 20 minutes till the guards came, nabbed me, and aggressively forced me to leave. You know, uh, Dubai, Dubai, get out. Uh, <laughs> so instead, I'm going to uh, Stalin's Dacha, which is just up this road hopefully but that you have to pay to get into but no one's gonna have problems with you so it'll be sweet yeah so i'm still walking up <coughs> oh, fuck. i'm still walking up the road to stalin's dacha uh, it's literally according to the sign back there it's about it's literally right around the corner finally making it to the steps of the dacha stalina this summer home. Oh, what a day. So here we are inside. Uh, this is part of Stalin's uh, dacha. So this is where he would uh, listen to music, have a smoke and a toke. Uh, he uh, used to play music and uh, his office all around here. It's very, very archaic. So uh, this used to be his desk used to be uh do, 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 do. so used to have used to have a table here yes yeah. uh, used to be a table here for eating and yeah it's not seen Stalin's time this um, glass is not preserved so. uh, no it's fine you can be in the video it's no problem <laughs> unless you want to be but uh so this was uh Vasily's personal balcony yeah oh no way so this is where Vasily would literally sit down just have a look over. Originally there was no glass or anything, so it would all be open. Oh yeah. Alright, yeah. So, I forgot to mention, uh, the doors in this building, the uh, Stalin Thatcher, are very, very interesting. Look, I'll show you. So, these locks, I'm told, were made in a very famous city in Russia called Tula, which is famous for building firearms, tanks and things like that. Heavy, heavy industry. Uh, big brass door handles, uh, bulletproof door, uh, amazing, very, very heavy. But the locking system on this, so how these locks worked is, uh, if you put, a, so the key you can see was obviously very big. If you put a key inside, you couldn't hear it turning. And it's the same on the other side. And it's the way it, the lock works in general. It's designed to be silent. So you wouldn't be able to hear what's happening, who's coming in or who's going where. So yeah, there's a lot of doors here have these special locks on them. Just 